opportunity. Um, I think it's one real big opportunity. That opportunity that I saw back in 2007 with regards to the equity capital markets, that opportunity that I saw back in the late 90s with regards to the technology space, that opportunity is now tenfold to what I'm seeing in the blockchain space today. We are here on the first day of Token 2049, coming live and direct from Hong Kong, yes. I'm here at Imperial College London, the heart of the Education Institute. We are here in South East London for the Venture Spring event. We are here today at the Crypto Compare Digital Asset Summit. We are here tonight to celebrate SBK Crypto's monthly meetup. SBK Crypto, you know, consistently puts on high quality events here in the heart of London. SBK is clearly the leader in community here in London. We do so many things for the community. We've got an awesome network and we do that by giving it all away, bringing people together, having meetups, creating content. We are now in a situation where we are educating, we're explaining, we're getting people up to speed about this opportunity. Not everybody sees it like we do. I'm going to be taking control of the moderation role for the next 30 minutes, so you're all in safe hands. I believe that the next wave of multi-billion dollar IPOs that will come through the capital markets will be coming out of the blockchain space. Or do you actually go out and add value? Do you actually go out and build communities? Do you add value to individual investors? Do you build a platform so that you can get companies whereby it's not just about them selling you, you have to sell them. So when you're picking a VC partner, don't just chase the books, don't just chase that. Chase someone who can actually help you with introductions, business development, hiring, managing the business. So you have to be a success. It's a partnership and it works both ways. We're long term. Like our fund is an eight to 10 year fund. Really, I've got a 20 year view on the space. It's not where the space is now. It's where it's going to be in 10 years and 20 years time. And for me, it's all about building those relationships now and not even worried about monetizing them. That will all come in the future. Stay in the game. Think long term, pick your winners and let them do what they want to do. Well, we're not investing into experiments. We're investing into great teams, into great projects, into great visions. And we're investing in people who have the ability to execute that.